what is ZR 2.8? Well, it is a configuration of Z axis that I never published officially. There are a few reasons for that, but uh, we'll go over the difference from this configuration. So first of all, we are making use of 16 millimeter ball screws for that configuration. So either four millimeter or five millimeter pitch for those 16 millimeter ball screws will need a WS-16 bubble X and will need a different type of attachment because of the bigger nut there is not enough clearance to use the old attachment style. So what I don't like about this configuration is the length between the attachment point on the Z, the, uh, Z slider mount and the pivot point on the bed. So this distance will be prone to one vibration, your bed will have a bigger impact on rotating this piece of the frame. The same thing applies to the real one, but the real one is even works because look at the distance and let me take a, another angle. So from this angle, you can see how long is that piece and you can quickly figure out that under creep with temperature and load, this part may start to sag. I'm using carbon fiber ABS and it is not so bad, but the parts are still uh, starting to show some, uh, some uh, deformation. Another thing that is to be considered is that uh, this system will have a bigger impact on your Z height. So it, consume, it consumes a fairly high amount of Z height due to this, this piece right here, the IGIS, which I managed to save a bit of height by re-drilling the holes into this black plastic part so they match the MGM-12 carriage right here. So no need to create an adapter or a spacer in between both. You can simply enlarge those holes and the bolt pattern will, will match. That summarizes most of the difference between ZR 2.8 and ZR 2.6. It is to be noted that the bed frame is exactly the same between all configurations. Happy printing.